Oh, puff balls. They're not ready. Oh, that one is. Yeah. But yeah, we found some white ones here that are some fair These are, fa I know, I know, they're fair size. So this one's a fresher one, so let's take a look and see what it is. Oh, wow. Wow. That might be a Matsutake. Wow. That looks nice. Oh, there's some... I know. Whoa. This might be a... Look at all this. this. Whoa, there's some giant things over here. Okay. Let's, uh, here, we're going to keep let's this one. Because this might be a Matsutake. Okay. So, these ones are actually going to help us kind of... These big ones here. Okay, so these are either Imperial Cats or Matsutakis. So these are actually edible. So we'll keep these. So grab a bag. Look at over here too. But only the good ones, because some of these are... Let's take a look. Yeah, these ones are far gone. But that one's perfect. Oh, it smells amazing. Yeah, these are either oh my Imperial Cats what, or Ma Matsutakis. So that's amazing. And if there's something else, I mean, I'm still going to obviously go through my books and fully identify them. Are these old black ones? Yeah. Just, yeah. All right, so take the good ones. Wow, wouldn't that be awesome if we find a bunch, eh? Yeah, these might be imperial cats, but either way, they're edible, so. There's, there's going to be more, so. Like, these ones here look pretty decent, actually. Here. Pretty good. Okay. Wow. Yeah, look at that. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah, those are, these are in really good condition, these ones. <gasps> they smell really good. Yeah. Oh, wow. All right. Oh, look, more. Yeah. Old, but, you know. Yeah, there's a bunch. All right. Cool. Okay. <laughs> There's a couple fresh mushrooms coming up. Oh, Oops. Yeah. Don't uh, don't rip out the mycelium. Sorry. Wow. Oh. Yeah. And here's another one. Um, if you film it from this side, like it's growing. Yeah, those are pretty small. Yeah, I'll leave that one. Well, actually, you know what? If these are Matsutakis, they, they do tend to grow low like that. So grab that one anyways right there. Wow. Yeah. There's, yeah, there's still a lot. Wow. Okay. Like leave growing those. right underneath. Grab that. Smells amazing. What about this one? Yeah, I guess you can pick that one if you want. Okay. Yeah, there's more coming underneath. Uh -huh. Cool. that one there. Okay. 
So these white mushrooms that we picked, um, this is the day after I've identified them. Um, they're not the uh, imperial cat, but they're very similar. Um, this is the mushroom. Catathalasma ventricosum. That's what I narrowed it down to. And uh, the difference between them and the imperial cats is the imperial cats get bigger. But basically they look very similar. And I think also the the imperial cats have more of a brownish color on the cap. But um, we tried them. They are kind of a... They have um, a smell of somewhat, uh, I guess, cucumber. And the taste is kind of mealy, but mild. They're all right, but a lot of these were bug-eaten already. Um, they had maggots all in them, so I kind of just discarded them because the f quality of table fare is not the greatest. Um, but again, they're mild flavored. Some books say that it's mild to unpleasant in taste. So I just don't think that they're a, uh, um, a choice edible mushroom.